55 years of friendship in Morocco. 1977 to 1979. Uh, we were both uh, English teachers. I taught mostly the sixth and seventh years. And I taught the what, fifth. fifth and sixth levels. Six months ago, a former student of mine, Mohammed El Korshi, managed to track me down on LinkedIn and we had been out of con contact for oh well, over 35 years. So I wrote a mail and I told him I don't really know if I'm writing to the right person. And I called it up and I said to A, I said, you're not going to believe this. You know, this is El Corsi. And then you know, after a few days while well, I received the mail and it, it made a big day, well, right? And uh, he told me, yes, I am. And, yeah, it was, it was wild. Yeah, you know? it's really great. And I say this, not out of flattery, but just out of fact, that he was my best student. <laughs> right, it's true. When he got back in touch with us, uh, we said, well, I have a big birthday coming up and Mohammed and I share the same birthday, so it just seemed like uh, providence that uh, we were meant to come to Morocco uh, at this time and celebrate our birthdays together. And that's what we did. So today is the eve of, of our birthday. birthday. A year ago, we didn't think, you know, something like this could ever happen. Okay, so. This is wonderful. Sure, it is. So, uh, what do we say? Let's eat. All right, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Mike is 70 and I am 59. So, did you say 39? 59. Oh. <laughs> uh, yesterday you asked me to make a wish. Yes. My wish was, well, I guess this is something you usually don't say. Okay. That this friendship could last forever. I hope so too. I hope so too. 